Police are still here on the scene, but Rosemont Street has been reopened. That driver killed and passengers on board the Amtrak train say it was devastating to see the wreckage. The mangled pickup truck involved in a fatal crash with a train in Haverhill is towed from the scene of the collision. Oh my goodness. Passengers on the Down Easter today got an up close view of the wreckage as the train pulled away. It was really sad. Really, it's devastating. I feel prayers to the family. 80 travelers were leaving Boston heading to Maine when the Amtrak train collided with a vehicle on the tracks on Rosemont Street. I was standing up in the bathroom and the train started bouncing. I started bouncing all over the place and I didn't know what was going on. And after probably 30, 40 seconds, it calmed down. Amtrak says the vehicle, which appears to be a pickup truck, was obstructing the tracks when the crash happened shortly before one this afternoon. It's unknown why the vehicle was on the tracks. Residents nearby say there's ample warning when trains come through. These do go at very high speeds, but you know, they put the arms down in plenty of time and they blow the whistle. This isn't a no whistle zone. The Amtrak says that none of the passengers, there were about 80 passengers on board that Amtrak train, was injured. Uh, some of the residents here say that drivers do try to go around the gates and beat the train. It is unclear exactly why this vehicle was on the tracks. The cause is under investigation. Live in Haverhill, Sarah Conji, WCVB News Center 5.